We thought we lived in a democracy with a balance of powers between three branches of government. We didn't think the Supreme Court, the Congress, and the voters could be told, we're going to tell you all, take a hike, we'll shut it all down if we don't have it our way. Come on, Congressman, that's not what this country's supposed to be about. Hey, Al, just a reminder, this isn't a democracy, it's a republic. And we're reflective of the oh, people that we represent. Oh, this is not a democracy. And it's a republic, Al. Look at the Constitution. The ideal of a democracy is universal equality. The ideal of a constitutional republic is individual liberty. A democracy always degenerates into dictatorship, which promises government-guaranteed equality and security, but it delivers nothing but poverty and serfdom for the people it robs and rules. America was founded as a constitutional republic to safeguard the liberties of the people against the tyranny of democracy or of one-man dictatorship. In this century, great strides have been made toward the goal of subverting our republic into a democracy. The foremost tactic of the subverters is subversion of language. By calling America a democracy until people thoughtlessly accept and use the term, the totalitarians have obscured the real meaning of our principles of government.